AC7 at 4, I'm Nicole Gomez. Now we do begin with two breaking news stories from our New Mexico mobile newsroom. An Air Force F-16 fighting Falcon jet crashed today near Alamogordo. Now the pilot has been taken to a hospital and that's according to a spokesperson at Holloman Air Force Base. Now the jet crashed near White Sands National Park this morning. ABC7's Jalen Lewis is live on the scene with the latest. Now Jalen, can you describe the scene for us? Thanks, Nicole. I am here at the White Sands National Park where that F-16 jet from Holloman Air Force Base came down. As you can see, that roadway is blocked off leading to that crash scene by park rangers. The crash scene itself is still about a half a mile to the west of where I am located. I will say that I was able to drive down there earlier, earlier today to the crash scene, but I was immediately turned around and escorted out by security forces. Meanwhile, while I've been standing here, security forces and emergency personnel have been going in and out of that area since I've been sitting here. We've been told to avoid the area to prevent possible exposure to hazardous chemical chemicals on board the aircraft, but according to a press release from the Holloman Air Force Base, the pilot, who was the only one on board of that aircraft at the time of the crash, was successfully ejected and transported by ambulance to an area hospital. At this time, it is unknown the extent of their injuries and the crash is still under investigation. Also, we were told that certain parts of White Sands National Park is still open to the public. Of course, this section is closed to the public. We will keep you updated as this story develops. Reporting from White Sands National Park, Jalen Lewis. Jalen, thank you for the latest and stick around for ABC 7 at 4. We'll